Liana Vasquez. And I'm Luann Khan. Well, let's go. Let's find out what Justin Peasy is doing today. Peasy Palooza. Where is Justin? Oh, we need to move on to a new oh. body part. <laughs> He is done talking New about bras. <laughs> no bras yeah. here. What, um, um, these are my feet. By the way, this is a scar from a unicycle incident on the 10 show. I, I just was asking, what do I get myself into? And why am I barefoot? Oh, on well, the don't 10 hurt show? yourself because, today. Do you guys like wine? Love um, wine. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Lushes. I knew you did. Look oh. at all this wine. What? How jealous are you to me? To, did we me fly to you to Napa? Where are you? Yes, we, it, this is like a slice of Napa in Cherry Hill. It's the oh. wine room of Cherry Hill, and they actually have grapes from Napa. Coming in now, it's time for those California grapes to be crushed and to make wine. And you can do it all right here. And not only can you stomp out grapes, but you can stomp out Alzheimer's here too. We're gonna tell you how it all happens. And I'm getting in. That's why I don't have socks and shoes on. I'm getting in, coming up, on the 10 show. No more breasts, all feet for the rest oh, of the show. Oh, we're so disappointed, Justin. No, can't wait to see what you're going to do next. Can't wait. We'll, we'll come back to you in a few minutes. In the, in the meantime, we have Justin Peasy to see what he's up to this afternoon. Morning. <laughs> I feel like a kid who's not allowed to get into the pool. I can't wait to jump into these grapes and do some stomping, but more importantly, to have some wine. The Ten Show is coming right back. <laughs> the classic TV sitcom, I Love Lucy. Lucy Ricardo stomps grapes in the Italian countryside, but today, Peasy Palooza is aiming for his very own I Love Lucy moment. <laughs> Explaining to do. <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting, waiting. Can I jump in now? Jump, baby, jump. We want to see you in those grapes. Yes. Yeah, Justin. <laughs> there we go. Oh, what does that feel like? What's that feel it like? It feels like heaven. Really? Because I know what's coming after it. I. Oh, but I just cannot even think of drinking <laughs> something that just. Touch came Justin's out of that, feet. yeah, no. <laughs> now, do they make you wash what are you your feet? saying about my feet? No, do I they just... make you wash them first before, like, do they have a little bath where they give you? No, I mean, I take a shower. Oh. <laughs> no. I mean, you... I wear clean socks. <laughs> <laughs> That's disgusting. What is it? Why are you stomping these <laughs> grapes you. today? Where are, I'm where glad these... you find my feet so disgusting. Oh. Um, no, yours so are probably cleaner than mine. let me tell you where we are. <laughs> this is the wine room of Cherry Hill. And it looks like you're in a little piece of Italy here. And I have said this a million times, but I was in Italy in June, and this just reminds me of it. And you have a chance to not only make your own wine, but stomp your own grapes. Now, Kenton Nice is the owner of the wine room of Cherry Hill. You actually do a little bit of crushing before, so people don't go right into the grapes, they get into this part of it. Yeah, the, uh, the opportunity to use your feet to stomp grapes is entirely uh, photographic, okay? It's not actually how we make the wine. We so use... you're not gonna make wine uh, with no, this? I, I, just what are you as, saying as about the, my feet? As the people back in the studio said, I'm not comfortable using the grapes that, uh, that uh, you've stomped with your feet. No. You, this is a chance at, at the wine room of Cherry Hill to make your own wine without having to do it in your basement. Um, how does it happen? What we do is we bring in premium grapes that are grown from us in California. So these are right from California, because this is the season right now. That's right. We're just kicking off the harvest now. It'll continue through the end of October. And then people like yourself come here three or four times over 10 months to actually crush, press, and eventually bottle your wine. But when you crush, you don't do it this way. No, no, no. We're using uh, authentic crushing equipment and pressing equipment from, from Italy, actually. Now, the cool thing too is not only do you get to pick everything out, you make your own label. What does it cost to do a half a barrel? Well, we work real hard at keeping the price at or about $10 a bottle. So there's 120 bottles in a half barrel, so it'd be around $12, $1,250. That's a really good deal. And especially, it's a great gift to give people when you make your own label and you've made your wine. Yes, it's, uh, it, it's exciting for people to take something that they've made and, and take it out to dinner or take it to other friends' house or just to give it as a gift, yes. Now, you're having a special event tomorrow that's free for people to come in and check out the place and stomp grapes themselves. They can do exactly what I'm doing. 
and it stomps out Alzheimer's. Yes, what we've done is we've kind of adopted the Alzheimer's as a group as our, uh, the charity that we, that we support. And they use our room a number of times throughout the year for events and things that they do. Um, tomorrow will be our third annual stomp out stomp out Alzheimer's event where we'll actually put about a thousand pounds of the same grapes you're stepping on uh, in a large pit and then we encourage people to come through take their shoes off and uh, and stomp the grapes as you are and then the wine room will donate ten dollars for each person that does that that's great it's it's great to come out and find out about this because it's a cool process and it ends up being it's a great Christmas gift because when is it done if you start now well the wine that we crush and press now will be bottled for next August the process actually is ten months you wow it takes the, that long we can see all the Oak barrels in the room. We to 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 generate the quality wine that we want. We uh, age everything in oak, and it does take a full ten months. And we have already aged peasy palooza wine. Well, we did, and you'll notice the alarm <laughs> clocks here. I, I was told that that was How the appropriate uh, uh, image to to include for you. Since I get up at two o'clock in the morning. That's right. This is a Sauvignon Blanc that we've labeled up for you, um, and I hope that you enjoy it. And. Uh, Share it with your friends. I think I will enjoy it. I mean, this is perfect. I Maybe I could just drink it while I'm crushing the grapes. <laughs> oh, guys. I think fun. that's a great plan. And Justin, you have done such a good job stomping those grapes. And everyone here at the studio is so impressed that we got you a prize. Here we are. This is the I Love Lucy stomping. Can you see this? Oh, yeah. Justin, you can't see it. You can't see it, but we'll describe the it I to Love you. The I Love Lucy doll in her grape stomping outfit. We should make a PC doll. That's perfect. Doll. And I'm going to get something from you. I'm going to bring you this grape juice back. Oh. To drink it. Thanks, oh, Justin. No. Actually, though, <laughs> yes, that's so disgusting. I, but I want to do it too. I do too. I, I, it looks I like fun. Stomp in the grapes. Looks like a lot of fun. Now, up next on the 10 show.